It's library day, and one of you gets to choose the book we'll read. Let's see now. Whose turn is it today? Me! It's my turn, Miss Honey. All right, Loli. This... Uh, one. You've made a wonderful choice, Loli. Can everyone see? Oh, boy! A story from the old days! It's the story of Uncle Willie and the Pirates. It took place many years ago when the people of Busytown worried whenever the fog rolled in. Well, everyone except the lighthouse keeper, Uncle Willie. Lucky you made it home safely through that fog. Lucky? No! The fog was so thick we couldn't see our noses. Then, when the fog lifted, all our cargo of sugar had disappeared from the deck. Every time that fog rolls into Busy Bay, things disappear from our ships. If you ask me, there's a sea monster out in the bay. A monster? No! It's a monster! A monster? Come now, there's no such thing as monsters. Willie, you're not going out fishing now. Why not? Well, for one thing, the fog's coming back. Willie, please don't go fishing today. Whoever or whatever is out in that fog. Don't you worry, Pastry. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Reckon I'll anchor at the island and have a little nap before lunch. <laughs> <laughs> what in the world is going on? I be Captain Black Whisker, sir, and honored we are to be guests aboard your fine vessel. Guess my eye. I know who you are. You're a bunch of pirates who've been looting our ships. Uh, easy, lads. Let's not be ungrateful. After all, our host has brought us a fine treasure. Hey, Captain. Here be lunch for us all. Right, lads? Now get your thieving hands off my lunch. Ha, <laughs> mateys. How shall we show him our gratitude? Heal all them. Make them walk the plank. Belay that. I've got a better idea. We'll maroon him on yonder isle. Heave-ho! When I get my hands free, I'll... I'll bring you to justice. <laughs> Enjoy your new home, you swabby, and be glad we're in a good mood. We be the kind of mates that like to toy with land lovers. <laughs> I can't let them get away with this. They've run up their pirate flag on my ship. And they're eating my lunch. So, the Busy Bay Monster's just a band of rotten pirates. Wait, sea monster? Now there's an idea. And so, Uncle Willie gathered up all the beach grass and seaweed he could find and wove it into a mat. Then he picked up driftwood and made it into a frame and used shells for teeth. Before long, he had built a pretty scary sea monster costume. All it needed was a tail. We'll see who toys with who around here. Ahoy, Captain Black Whiskers. Sea monster off the starboard bow. Sea monster! Ah! ah speak up, you bilge rat. It sounded like you said sea monster. Uh, hey, that's what I said. Are you daft? There'd be no such thing as a sea monster. Don't tell me, Captain. Tell it! Shiver me timbers! A 
locked us in. Reckon I did. Now, what was it you mates were saying about playing with landlubbers? That be no sea monster. For that captain in a disguise. Ah, and we fell for it. Hook, line, and sinker. I think I see Uncle Willie's boat. Maybe so, but it doesn't look like Willie at the helm. It looks like... Like a sea monster! Oh, help! Oh, help! Wait a minute. I'd know those feet anywhere. Willie, what are you doing in that get-up? Getting my boat back. Constable Murphy, I present you with the monster of Busy Bay and the pirates who've been robbing our ships. Why, Willie, you're so brave. And hungry. Those pirates ate my lunch. <laughs> well, let's go and make you another lunch. Miss Honey, speaking of lunch, when's ours? <laughs> <laughs> 